गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी लर्न अबाउट ब्लड वेसल्स फ्रॉम बी एस सी थर्ड इयर क्लास पेपर नंबर सेकंड मैमिलियन हिस्टोलॉजी ब्लड सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम मेनली कंसिस्ट हार्ट ब्लड वेसल्स ब्लड्स दैट इज ब्लड फैस्कुलर सिस्टम टुडे वी लर्न अबाउट ब्लड वेसल्स द ब्लड वेसल्स आर ट्यूबुलर स्ट्रक्चर विथ फेरिंग डायमीटर एंड थिकनेस ऑफ देअर वॉल देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ ब्लड वेसल्स इन सर्क्युलेटरी सिस्टीम देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ ब्लड वेसल फर्स्ट वन इज अर्ट्रीज सेकंड फेन्स एंड थर्ड इज कैपिलरीज ब्लड वेसल डिवाइडेड इंटू थ्री पार्ट्स अर्ट्रीज वेन्स एंड कैपिलरीज लेटस स्टार्ट विथ अर्ट्रीज दीज अर्ट्रीज आर ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज कंडक्टिंग अर्ट्रीज बिकॉज दे कंडक्ट ब्लड फ्रॉम हार्ट टू द मीडियम साइज अर्ट्रीज हेयर अर्ट्रीज डिवाइडेड इंटू अगेन थ्री टाइप्स फर्स्ट टाइप इज इलेस्टिक अर्ट्रीज सेकंड टाइप इज मीडियम मीडियम साइज मस्क्युलर अर्ट्रीज third type is small terminal arteries or artery holes arteries divided into three parts elastic arteries medium size the muscular arteries and small terminal arteries and artery hole let us start with elastic arteries these elastic arteries are also called as conducting arteries because they conduct blood from heart to the medium sized arteries example dorsal aorta pulmonary artery these arteries wall shows different Quotes, intima, media, and adventitia layer. These arteries wall again divided into tunica, intima layer, tunica media, and adventitia layer. Tunica intima. made up of an epithelium which is single layer of flattened endothelial cells together with supporting layer of elastic rich collagen fibers tunica media layer in this tunica media layer numerous elastic membrane collagen fibers smooth muscles present as well as fibroblast cells are present in this media layer next layer is adventitia layer this adventitia layer contains large arteries needs their own blood supply so it contains blood vessels called as fossa fossorium these arteries needs blood own blood supply and this own blood supply arteries called as fossa fossorium and this vaso vasarium which forms the capillaries and gives the nourishment to the aortal wall second type of artery is medium sized muscular arteries these arteries distribute blood to various parts of the body example 
femoral and coronary wall of the arteries they have lot of smooth muscles which means that they are able to contract and relax to change amount of blood delivered as needed large amount of muscles in the tunica media in the tunica media large amount of muscles present so it is called as muscular arteries it also contains elastic collagen and reticular fibers tunica adventitia this tunica adventitia is very broad and mostly contains collagen and elastin it also contains fascia fasorium capillaries next type is small terminal arteries and artery holes these small terminal arteries wall again divided into three parts intima media and adventitia these terminal arteries having diameter 130 mu small arteries having diameter 130 mu and artery holes diameter is 100 mu or less than 100 mu this diameter is less than 100 mu in the intima of small arteries the muscle cells shows thickness from one to several layers while in artery holes only one to two layers are forms in small arteries several muscle layers are present but in artery holes one to two layers are present elastica externa is absent in this both cases elastic elastic externa is absent in artery small arteries and artery holes next type is fence these fence again divided into three parts these fence again divided into three parts large fence first division is large fence first division is large vein second division is medium sized vein medium sized vein and third division is third division small veins or venules small vein or venules these veins divided into three parts large vein medium sized vein small vein and venules let us start with large vein the entire wall veins are larger than the arteries and they carry blood from capillaries network to the heart their walls are much thinner because of the great reduction of muscular layer and elastic elements this entire wall of large vein it is soft and more loosely organized than in arteries it tends to collapse when not filled with the blood this large veins again includes the precavals innominates and these precavals and innominates intima contains endothelium cells rest on the basal lamina here his diagram shows endothelial cells these endothelial cells rest on the basement membrane it is also called as basal lamina these are supported by longitudinal collagen elastic fibers media these large vein media shows thin and poorly developed contains only few smooth muscles are present adventitia layer this large vein adventitia layer is thickest part of the wall consist of 
लूज कनेक्टिव टिश्यू विथ इलास्टिक कोलैजिन फाइबर्स एंड लॉन्जिट्यूडनल बंडल्स ऑफ स्मूथ मसल फाइबर्स फासा फैसोरियम इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट इन लार्ज फेन नेक्स्ट टाइप इज मीडियम साइज रेन दीज मीडियम साइज रेन्स इन्क्लूड्स लार्ज फेन्स ब्रांचेस सच एज फ्री केबल्स इनोमिनेट ब्रांचेस आर इन्क्लूडेड इन द मीडियम साइज फेन्स एक्सेप्ट मेन ट्रंक इंटीमा इन दीज मीडियम साइज फेन इंटीमा शोज थीन विथ पॉलिगोनल इंडोथेलियल सेल्स मीडिया दीज मीडिया थीन कंपोज ऑफ सर्क्युलर मसल फाइबर्स कोलैजीन इलास्टिक कनेक्टिव टिश्यू एंड एडवेंटिशिया दीज एडवेंटिशिया इन दीज मीडियम साइज वेन इज वेल डेवलप्ड नेक्स्ट टाइप इज स्मॉल फेन्स एंड फेन्यूल्स दीज स्मॉल फेन्स एंड फेन्यूल्स आर स्मॉलेस्ट फेन्स कॉल्ड एज फेन्यूल्स स्मॉलेस्ट वेन इट इज कॉल्ड एज फेन्यूल्स एंड दीज फेन्यूल्स एडवेंटिशिया कोट इज थीक एज फेन इंक्रीजेस इन साइज एंड द मसल्स बिकम्स मेनी लेयर्ड मीडिया ऑफ दीज फेन्यूल्स दीज आर कोलेजिनस इलास्टिक फाइबर्स एपियर्स नेक्स्ट पार्ट इज कैपिलरीज द नेक्स्ट पार्ट कैपिलरीज दीज कैपिलरीज हैविंग फेरी स्मॉल डायमीटर एंड दीज कैपिलरीज अगेन डिवाइडेड इंटू थ्री टाइप्स दीज कैपिलरीज अगेन डिवाइडेड इंटू थ्री टाइप्स फर्स्ट टाइप इज कंटिन्युअस कैपिलरी फर्स्ट टाइप इज कंटिन्युअस कैपिलरी सेकंड टाइप फर्स्ट कंटिन्युअस सेकंड फेनिस्ट्रेटेड कैपिलरीज सेकंड टाइप इज फेनिस्ट्रेटेड कैपिलरीज एंड थर्ड टाइप इज साइनोसाइडल कैपिलरीज साइनोसाइडल कैपिलरीज दीज कैपिलरीज आर डेलिकेट ट्यूब्स एवरेज डायमीटर इज अबाउट सेवन टू नाइन म्यू एवरेज डायमीटर इज अबाउट सेवन टू नाइन म्यू एंड कैपिलरीज आर वन सेल थीक कंटेनिंग फ्लैटनड इंडोथेलियल सेल्स रेस्ट ऑन द बेसल लैमिना दीज सेल्स आर जॉइन बाय they are edges and two formed capillary tube these endothelial cells join to each other with the edges and forms capillary tube structure the endothelial cells contains usual cell organelles these endothelial cells cytoplasm contains cell organelle as well as perisomes are present in the cytoplasm as well as pinocytic fascicles these are also present on these cells as at some places these special cell called as pericytes with multiple process are associated with the capillaries and due these special cells are called as pericytes these pericytes are associated with the capillaries here we observe in this diagram these pericytes are special cells present in the blood capillaries which gives mechanical support to the capillaries and also phagocytic in function these pericytes cell is gives mechanical support to the capillary as well as phagocytic in functions these capillaries again divided into three parts Uh, in first part continuous capillaries 
these continuous capillaries found in the muscle these continuous capillaries found in the muscles and their endothelium is uh, endothelium and basal lamina is pores here this uh, endothelium and basal lamina here pores are present and this continuous capillary shows pores next type is fenestrated capillaries and these fenestrated capillaries found in intestinal wall these fenestrated capillaries found in intestinal fila their endothelium has numerous fenestration it is also called as pores and these are about 300 to 800 and strong unit 300 to 800 and strong unit pores is present in fenestrated capillaries next type is sinusoidal capillaries and these capillaries occurs in the endocrine gland these capillaries occurs in the endocrine gland mainly these capillaries having large diameter endothelial cells have pores example liver and spleen in the liver and spleen large sinusoidal space present and these sinusoids having large diameter this lining shows phagocytic cells or cuper cells are present in the sinusoidal space in the liver the large sinusoidal space space present and lining of this sinusoidal space cuper cells as well as phagocytic cells are present in these sinusoidal capillaries this is all about the histology of blood vessels thank you